so violent she looked like a murder case and in now hoodies in case that she run away they said she run away what's going on guys it's Lars back with another video how are you guys doing on this beautiful 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 uh Monday morning uh, anyway in today's video uh with all the memes going around uh today we're gonna be talking about aliens uh you I'm sure you guys have seen uh with all the vi um can that quit happening with all the things coming out uh about area fifty one um it got me interested and today basically what we're gonna be exploring is is it even possible to reach the base let alone get inside of the base um basically what i've come up with is it's likely not even possible to get there um first of all uh these 30 these 300,000 people that are planning to go um they don't all live in nevada because well nevada is a desert no people don't live there um well, not many people live there. Sorry if you live in fucking Nevada. Um, Mountain Dew, no sponsor. No sponsor, Alienware. But Alienware, you can sponsor this video if, you, if you'd like to. You know, this is like a gamer fucking thing. Monster. Not Monster. Mountain Dew. So basically what this says here is, uh, yes, people have been inside Area 51, obviously, because it's a military base um, that they house advanced uh weaponry and probably test nuclear um nuclear uh weaponry and uh advanced weaponry um but uh technically someone could have entered um area 51 but uh no one knows if anyone has ever done that without being allowed to have access there um obviously this is all coming after um, the one guy. What was his name? What was his name? Um, you guys know what I'm talking about. The guy who basically said that he worked on a UFO inside of Area 51. And I'm pretty sure that that is what ended up sparking this um, and growing interest in uh, actually going to Area 51. No, it's to clap alien cheeks, you dumbass. I, I get that we want to clap alien cheeks. But to get to get there, it's, it's more than just, you know, drive, drive. You can't just drive. It's... A seabed. The, the the base is by an ocean. A, it used to be not an ocean. A, it's a dried out lake bed. That's desert now. Crossing desert is much harder than you think. Um, the the nearest town is uh, Rachel. I wasn't able to figure out how many miles away that that would be to get to uh, Area 51. But it doesn't sound like driving would even be an option. Uh, due to the fact that the seabed is completely dry. I mean, the lake. Fuck. Can't talk. Um, so I don't know if you'd even be able to drive. Uh, so if it's miles out, then that's miles hike for teenage kids mainly that are fucking sharing memes. Um, I get that this is all a joke, but it, it is very interesting to think uh, if we even could get there. Um, if we could even get inside, um, no one has actually been inside Area 51. Um, this, I th where, where was it? Oh, I think I deleted it. But they basically have, they're armed to the teeth. Uh, they're not fucking playing games. Uh, and we might be playing games. So, I don't know how this is all gonna go. Um, if the people did reach it, I don't think that they would survive. Uh, it's a, it even said here, you know, if you got inside, um, you would likely disappear immediately. I don't even think I turned on the uh, the frame here. I'll show you guys. Uh, yeah, there we go. Come on. Can you work? If this thing can work. Come on. Come on. So basically, what my conclusion is, I've done a lot of research throughout the day. Uh, Rachel is likely miles away from uh, Area 51, given that we don't actually know the exact coordinates of Area 51 due to the fact that it is a restricted flying zone. Uh, similar to GTA 5, 
uh, the military base, if you fly above it, basically you're getting blown out of the sky uh, with no remorse. Um, so yeah, I don't think that, um, here, there we go. And I'll show you guys real quick what I'm, what I'm looking at. I guess this will minimize. Um, but basically there's no way we could get in there, sadly, um, that I know about. Um, we could because if we tried to go f through the sky, we'd probably get blown out of the sky. Um, I want to see aliens as much as you guys. But, sadly, I don't think that we can fucking do that, uh, logically speaking. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. You think this is all a joke? You think it's going to blow over uh, in a couple months? Do you think these 300,000 people are just fucking around? 800,000 now, by the way. 800,000? Okay, 800,000. I don't give a fuck how many, um, I guess... 800,000. 800,000 people we got counter versus, versus guns, bro. Like, like we don't have guns. Like, well, how do we not have guns? We're American citizens. I know, we have guns, but we don't have fully automatic rifles. Yes, we do. Nuclear technology. They're not going to drop a nuke on us. First off, that would just kill them. Then we they they could another, bomb us. Then we just send another thing. They could launch a missile at us. Okay, and then we'll fucking pick it up and throw it back. Obviously. Anyway, whatever happens, I think that September 19th, I'm going to be going down to Nevada uh, just to see what happens. If this continues going on uh, and if it keeps gain gaining steam, um, if it kind of blows over, then I probably won't end up going. But uh, if it keeps uh, going strong once the date gets closer, uh, I'm going to drive down there. Um, it's a two-day drive. Um so I guess you guys can look forward to that in the future. Um, I'm not fucking attacking Area 51. I'm not getting missiled. Um, but if there's going to be a shit ton of people who are, I want to fucking see it because oh, I, I love seeing weird shit. So uh, you guys have a great day. And uh, leave a like, subscribe, and hit that post notification bell to stay up to date. Leave a like. Leave a dislike. See you guys. We're against you here. No one's here, bro. No one's coming. Everyone's soft. Hmm. Like, I'm not stabbing no one, bro. Come on, guys. We're back on the iPhone, sadly. But I have to come to you in drastic need. So after filming that video um, and marking that I was going to go to Area 51, uh, I got a... Uh, Facebook notification um, didn't know and it said someone had messaged me I don't really get a lot of messages I proceeded to text back this man uh, asking what he wanted uh, this man um, has a very strange name um, I'm not gonna put it in the video due to uh, his personal privacy but I have reason to believe that this man is an alien um, I basically took a picture of his face um, we went on to a, a face merger. We merged it with an alien. And, um, well, you guys can see. Um, obviously, this man, um, it's, it's a perfect match. He's, he's 100% an alien. Uh, I don't know what to do with this information. Uh, I don't know if I'm safe or if the government might abduct me. Um, immediately after saying that I'm going to be visiting Area 51, I received a message. Um, I would hope that this isn't the end, but if it is, just know that they're hiding it. And uh, I also told him that this crusade that is going to happen cannot be stopped. We will find out the truth for good, for bad, or worse.